Greetings, everyone, and welcome to Truth Council 23 with me, your sister friend, Truth Nunez, and our spiritual council. We're so honored, grateful, and thankful to be here with all of you to share today's collective energetic read. Keeping in mind, we're reading collective energies, so take what resonates and leave what doesn't, because you are and forever will be the masters of your experiences. Of what you will or what you will not into this creation, it is totally up to you my lovies we're just reading the energies channeling the energies we're so honored and grateful my lovies to be doing this work thank you so much for your likes your shares your comments thank you for your subscribes we're almost at 7500 subscribers even though uh, we got hackers multiplying they're multiplying it for us my lovies spirit's gonna multiply it tenfold their karma will be tenfold too but uh, we're almost at 7500 subscribers my lovies dang we're on our way to 8000 my lovies 8000 sister all my lovies, we could do no wrong. My lovies, we gonna break into song. My lovies, <laughs> um, I love music. My lovies, uh, for some of you, you love music because you understand the spiritual. Uh, the, the the Reese the Reese what's up Reese uh, Teresa for some what's up Teresa what's up Josephine what's up Joseph what's up Joey what's up everybody um Uncle Joey for some you understand the musical repercussions of. Uh, of life you understand the repercussions of music on life you understand the effects of music on life you understand vibrations for some of you you really like to play music for some of you you like to play music while you while you dance definitely um for some of you you like to play music while you uh clean for some of you you like to play background music for some of you you like to play black black blackout something about blackout something about a blackout shirt <coughs> oh why that, my lovies? Um, a gym rat. Um, for some of you, you like to play music. You like music. You like, uh, um, you're always listening to music for some of you. Music is very present right now. But um, someone's very pregnant right now, my lovies. But um, uh, yeah, for those who've been here, um, or welcome to the new ones, but for those who've been here a while, you're no you'll notice that um, uh, if you like music, I'm very sensitive to music. I've always been. I've always been a little, a little dancer, a little singer. I've, I've always loved to sing, to dance. And uh, um, when I was in high school, I was on the, I was in chorus, and I was on the dance team as well. And since I was a little girl, I've always loved to dance. So music is very important to music. To, to music, yes, absolutely. Music is the soul of the man. I'm going on music, baby. Music makes a happy day. Fit funky, funky, fee fee. Funky, funky, funky. Music makes the clouds go by, baby. Yes, it does. <laughs> your music, you're into music. For some of you, you're so into music. Music dominates your life. Uh, can we move on? <laughs> you, gotta move, you gotta be strong. We gotta move on. Bill someone's into sciences but um welcome my lovies welcome everybody welcome welcome thank you so much my lovies thank you for your support thank you for your messages my lovies thank you for your kindness um it really means a lot my lovies um spirit told us that this is you know this is our work we have to do this um we don't have a choice right joyce right joellen right mary ellen for some marielle maria marlene marlene for some um but um we don't have a choice we must we must do what we must do my lovies and uh the fact that you come here someone's a jew the fact that you come here my lovies or some of you are jewish or jews are important to you but um the fact that you come here my lovies is really really beautiful i think it's beautiful i think that um your support is really beautiful i get really beautiful messages as well um I had a, a one message in particular which echoes um, a few people have said this and just on this channel alone I in person you know in person it's almost like I know the value of this work so when I hear these things um, it's not that necessarily like I'm more or less surprised but when you you know again at a distance because again I am also a Reiki master so um, I've always had the gift of channeling and of, of connecting via even long distances and so um, when people say you know you make me feel safe you make me um, 
you you're like a boost of energy to me um, you make me feel lighter about the things that are happening in my life um, you make me feel protected you make me feel like I can keep going um, oh my gosh confirmation I just got a call um, you make me feel like I can keep going you make you make me feel you make me feel like a natural woman <laughs> um, it really makes it makes me feel good my lovies it really does especially because again um, people are deliberately trying to sabotage this work people are deliberately trying to leave your sister friend out people have deliberately caused issues not only in this work but in my other work which is my primary uh, source of income and so the fact that you support me especially through these times um it really means a lot even you know even my life's on the line it's so crazy my lovies it's, it's crazy um some people are nuts my lovies but the fact that um i have your support it really means a lot thank you for those who have donated again um your sister friend is 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 living off of uh pennies at this particular time um actually to be to be specific we have like 20 something dollars to our name <laughs> we have like 20 something dollars to our name my lovies and um the fact that um people are tactless and ruthless my lovies but it's all right it's all right everybody gets theirs but um the fact that you come here and that you support it um i think i'm a firm believer my lovies that everything happens for a reason i'm a firm believer everything happens for a reason i also know my heart so i am a firm believer that everything happens for a reason um it just reinforces my love for you tonight i celebrate my love for you um because if it wasn't for you if it wasn't for this work if it wasn't for you my lovies at this at these last few days if it wasn't for you your sister friend um it would have been things would have been looking a little a little tight it's like a little gray um but um and for god for god for God for waking me up from from someone that was trying to attack me energetically with uh, freaking directed energy weapons. That's fucking crazy, my lovies. That's crazy, and it it opened. It gave me such an epiphany. But um, something about Tiffany, dang, my lovies. Something about Tiffany Haddish. Dang, my lovies. Some people are heartless, ruthless, but they got a lot of money though. At least you know. I got my soul. I'm wealthy in my soul, my lovies. I'm wealthy in my goals, my lovies. Um, it's out of my control, my lovies. But um, let's thank the ancestors, my lovies. Again, thank you so much for your... Um before we move on thank you so much thank you for your contributions my lovies it really means a lot if you're moved to donate you can definitely donate all of the information is in the description box or in the pinned comment at the top any amount matters my lovies any amount matters again any all lives matter um any amount matters my lovies um i am so thankful i really am i'm so thankful for everyone um you know it means a lot it just means a lot i know that this work means a lot to you but the fact that you give back to the work uh, you don't have to you really don't again there are people that i know are millionaires and they could give two shits in fact they're trying to put things in place to make this happen uh the fact that you actually are like no we're gonna show up for our sister friend however we can um that means a lot my lovies that means so much it really does it means so much to me you're not doing it because you're getting something out of it necessarily but um the fact that you just do it i it just it's a, re a really beautiful thing thank you my lovies love y'all my lovies i really do i really do i really really do and i'm gonna keep showing up for you um with that being said let's thank the ancestors my lovies the name kimberly was very present in the preliminary and the name clarkston was very present in the preliminary those two names were very present in the preliminary let's thank our ancestors my lovies let's thank the real mvps uh those that um guide and love and protect us i saw beetles today my lovies the green beetle when i see the green beetle om jesus is such a good sign i love it my lovies it's such a good sign everything's gonna be all right <laughs> we want to thank our ancestors i want to honor and thank my grandmama the real MVP I want to honor and thank in my life. Your grandmama should be the MVP in your life, my loves. Actually, you should be the MVP in your life, my loves. But um, I want to thank my grandmama. Lucero for some of you. Lourdes for some of you. I want to thank my grandmama. Abuelita Gladys. Something about Mary Ellen for some of you. 
I want to honor and thank my grandmama. Abuelita Gladys Nunez Maldonado. I also want to, Josephine. I also want to honor and thank my grandpapa, Abuelito Felix Antonio Nunez. I invite you to do the same. I do honor and thank all of your trusted ancestors that are mine too. Those that protect, and what is up with the winks, my lovies? You love the wink. Um, that uh, love and protect and guide you, my lovies. I invite you to honor whatever spiritual force, whatever religious force, whatever makes you feel good, grounded, and connected to the all as you are in this experience. You can also take a moment of silence to be in silence with yourselves, and that's also more than enough. Let's get started, my lovies. Let's get it started, my lovies. My lovies, we want to finish our raffle, but you understand your sister friend. I got stuff in my mind, but we want to finish our raffle because we do foresee that um, that our raffle is going to happen, my lovies. It's going to happen. It's going to happen. It's definitely going to happen. Spirit. Ooh. It's gonna happen, my lovies. Someone's gonna get fired. Ooh, my lovies. In the preliminary, um, there's a gentleman uh, who's really disturbed. This gentleman's really disturbed in his life. The gentleman has a real big inner fight. You had a few gentlemen, and this person's such a liar too. Um, but um, this gentleman uh, has been secretly, again, for some of you, you know, it is what it is. This is where we're at, my lovies. The cleanup crew. Uh, Spirit is doing the cleanup, and people don't like it. But, um... There's this gentleman who has been like in the shadows, uh, kind of trying to sabotage you, uh, for some of you. This is, it came up as a dark skinned man, but dark skin, light skin, take it how it resonates for you. Uh, king of pentacles energy. So a Taurus could be significant or, um, a fire sign is coming in too. So Sagittarius, Aries, and Leo energy. Um, these, uh, these people, or it could be a group of men for some, they're going to go through a shit show. They're about to go through a shit show. I don't know why they're so worried about you. This is what it feels like like i'm like so why are they worried about my lovies because it didn't even make sense they should actually be worried about themselves because they have a tower and a half coming uh it came in with the tower and death so um it did come in for some you could actually be learning that one of these men actually dies uh for others uh who's a spy uh for others or was spying on you and lying on you for others um you could just be hearing that these men or a group of men you know these men for some of you you know who these men are like you know who these men are um again this energy could be expressing itself in various different various different um uh ways and contexts so take it how it resonates for you but you know who is channeling this frequency and um they're about to go through it they're about to go through it i'm like <laughs> i mean it is what it is the inner fight is real. It is what it is, my lovies. My lovies, you like my hair? You liked my up too, my lovies? You like my hair up? You're so cute, my lovies. Um, I did it for you because I wanted to switch it up. But today we did braids. We did like braids. I like the braids because um, in the summertime, the thing is like I've really, especially like so three years ago, everything is coming in for a reason. You're about to sh shave your head, Cheyenne. You're about to shave your head, my lovies. Um, three years ago or do something drastic to your hair something about drastic the a dance crew for some of you um three years ago no two years ago promises were all you heard my lovey's broken promise thomas for some of you um <laughs> i'm hearing i hate it when you say that you call somebody of uh, you call somebody out on their broken promises my lovey's um but um three years ago was it almost it was almost three years ago i shaved off my hair my lovies your sister for your, your sister friend went bald it looked so cute i actually was thinking about it yesterday i'm like dang i don't know if i would do it again because it was only supposed to be like a one-time once in a lifetime thing i had shaved like my side before your sister friend when she was a little bit um when she was uh especially working for Verizon I I explored so many different hairdos hairstyles hair colors I used to do highlights dyed my hair red dyed my hair blonde half of it was blonde half of it was red the sides were blonde it was it was intense like I did a lot I did quite a bit back then uh my subby my, my subbies my subbies suv uh back then they didn't want you now you're hot they're all on you back then they didn't want you now you're <laughs> that's that's what's coming back then they didn't want me now i'm hot they all on me back then back then they didn't want you my lovies now you're hot and they're all on you dang my lovies dang gotta be strong gotta move on what a cute little intro today <laughs> what a cute intro. the energies feel like really like um 
lighthearted. Don't, for some of you, if you're experiencing a lot of headaches, don't take it too, don't take it personal. <laughs> don't take it personal, my loveys. If you're experiencing a lot of headaches, don't take it personal. Try to relax. Just try to pay your taxes for some of you. Your taxes, your business taxes, my loveys. Tax evasion has been very present, my loveys. If spirit is telling you, uh, for some of you, spirit's telling you, don't worry about your money right now. If you can find resources to support you. For some of you, you are fine when it comes to money. For some of you, tax evasion. <laughs> I'm just the messenger. I am just the messenger. Boom, boom, bye. Especially if you have a French last name or France is important to you or Spain. If you have a family that comes from Spain. So European, very important. Pay your taxes. <laughs> boom, boom, by a good. And they're slow as molasses. Here we go with the slow as molasses. Slow as molasses is back. This one wants to speak with you. So they're all Zach. Something about Zachariah. Something about Zachary. To the all, to the all, to your unconditional love and your mercy. To your divine wisdom. To your all knowing, to your all being, to your all seeing power. What are the highest messages, the most truthful messages, the most just messages? To mi abuelita Gladys Núñez Maldonado. To mi abuelita Gladys Núñez Maldonado. To mi abuelita Gladys Núñez Maldonado. To mi abuelito Félix Antonio Núñez. Negative emotions. To mi abuelito Félix. A little burp, so they're stuck. To mi abuelito Félix Antonio Núñez. To mi abuelito Félix Antonio Antonio Nunez, the name Tony to Mama Merced, to the name Anthony to Mama Merced, the name Antonio to Mama Merced, to Shango, to Shango, to Shango, to Yemaya, to Yemaya, to Yemaya, to Papa Legba, to Papa Legba, to Papa Legba, to Elegua, to Elegua, to Elegua, to Oshun, to Oshun, to Oshun, to Ogun. To Ogun, to Ogun, to the Santa Muerte, to la Santa Muerte, to la Santa Muerte, to all of the archangels that love and protect and guide us, to all of the archangels that protect and love and guide us, to all of the archangels that protect and love and guide us, who are the highest messages, the most truthful messages, the most just messages. The name Vivian, the name Vivian, Nemve, 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 what is that? Nemve? <clears throat> Um, <clears throat> the name Anastasia. Whew. To the all, to the all knowing, to the all being, to your all seeing power, to the all, to your unconditional love, to your all knowing, to your all being, to your all seeing power, to the all, to your unconditional love and your mercy, to your all knowing, to your all being, to your all seeing power. What are the highest messages? the most truthful messages, the most just messages, in love and truth and courage, in love and truth and wisdom, in love and truth and honor, in love and truth and justice, in love and truth and courage, in love and truth and wisdom, in love and truth and honor, in love and truth and judgment, in love and truth and courage, in love and truth and wisdom, in love and truth and honor, in love and truth and mercy. What is up? What is up? What is up? Hot stuff. How's it going, my lovies? How's it flowing, my lovies? What's popping, my lovies? What's cracking, my lovies? Are reading for my darlings. Reading for my darlings. Reading for my darlings. It is true. We're reading for you and we love you. You know that is true, my lovies. Let's do it, my lovies. Get to it, my lovies. Do it, my lovies. Ego stroking. We got ego stroking in the field. Dang, my lovies. You're getting your ego stroked. It's a joke, my lovies. Um, we're reading for when are we reading for? We're reading for the 19th. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at look at that. 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 Look at look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Tabitha, 19 energy. 19 energy in numerology is 10 energy. And what is 10 energy? 10 energy brings in a one. <laughs> You've won, my lovies. You've won. One is the new beginning of a situation. One energy brings in a completion of a cycle for a new beginning. You were patient, my lovies. You were so patient in a situation. And that in the, in, in a, the, in, here we go, intuit, payment gateways, Inuit, some type of Eskimo. And you have intuitive, you were intuitive about a situation. For some of you, you used your better judgment. You did not, you did not use anybody. You didn't use anybody. Um, spirit's commending you for something. I don't know what you're being commended for, but it feels great. <laughs> we kind of know. For some of you, you're acting like you don't know something, but you know. And if you don't know, you now you're about to know. <laughs> for some of you, um, you really, you know very, you know very well who you are, Barry. <laughs> Barry's been very present for some of you. You're about to be recognized for something, my lovies. Um, specifically your patience. You were patient. You were 
extraordinarily patient like your sister friend patient you have been so patient in the face of adversity and spirit is really like i want you to know that again it's not about the horse <laughs> it's not about it's not about the horse it's about the channels it's about the energies for those who don't know in Spanish, uh, we say se montó el caballo, male or female, it doesn't matter. Uh, we say el caballo uh, for someone who is a channeler, who channels energies and spirits. And your sister friend is a caballo. So I channel fen fentanyl and felony. Boom. There it is. Whoop, there it is. Whoop, there it is. Fentanyl and felony for somebody. Um, for your F buddy for some. Um, oh, there's a there's a green beetle and everything is going to be all right. Um, they're all going to prison anyway. I mean, they knew, they knew. It's like all the hidden plays. Spirit's not playing, my lovies. Look at what fentanyl's doing to the people, my lovies. I mean, not to everybody. I don't really see it to be quite frank, but from, from what I hear, from what I hear, I don't run in those circles. I, I stay away from, from those things, my lovies. But for some of you, you're going to find out that someone's catching a felony. Or for some of you, this could be you, my lovies. I'm just a messenger here. I love you all, my lovies. Love you all. Love you, Paul. Bye. Um, all they do is lie, but it's okay because Spirit's going to commend you for some of you. For some of you, Spirit was G G Gavin, Gavin and Gary. Spirit was giving us something about Gary. Um, Spirit was uh, something about Garfield. Uh, Spirit was giving us, I'm seeing also Garfield the cat. For some of you, your cats have been very present or all types of cats. Uh, someone likes tigers though, because we were showing us how like Garfield kind of reminds me a little of a tiger in a way. What was Garfield? Anyways, um, everything is coming in for a reason. Spirit was giving us like people that not only were they into like, for example, like not only were they doing screwing around like let's say selling fentanyl in addition to that they were also trying to play extortionist trying to bribe people lying on people playing all types of stalker games like all but a bunch of shit just being bullies like just really being like menaces really menaces someone likes the menace to society movies um liars stalkers like everything is coming in for a reason but you remained patient for some of you you remain patient again just take what resonates what wherever your shoe fits on the story my lovies everybody plays a, a role in the story though um you were patient my lovies you were patient even as people were trying to uh, sabotage your life you were patient for some of you as people were trying to sabotage your wife uh you were patient you and your wife you and your partner uh, you were patient when it came to your thug life family members trying to do stupid junk um you were patient when it came to fake friends you were patient when it came to so many things and now you have a new beginning you have one energy you have a new beginning you have something that is going to be fruitful you have something that <clears throat> is going to feel like a blessing to you it's going to feel like a weight's been lifted off your shoulder for some of you something really beautiful is coming in uh maybe you're meeting someone new for some of you in the preliminary it was present a very important meeting with a stranger something's going to be very important a new meeting uh you're gonna meeting you're gonna meeting you're gonna meeting you're in a meeting for some of you you're about to be in a meeting for some of you there's going to be an important meeting for you whatever meeting you're having right now it's an important meeting that could really change something for you so uh an important meeting with a stranger that's how it came in in the preliminary so don't be afraid for some of you no stranger danger uh in fact for some of you your your strangers are are less tactless and more and more your soul tribe than your actually non-stranger per people perverts they're perverts in the field too anyways um but um for some of you child molestation was very present my lovies um It's like someone's playing blind, but they know putting the children in harm's way with these crazy ass people and then thinking that you have to de 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 diesel, diesel, something about Denise, something about Dakota, something about Kodak, something about a Kodiak bear. Kodiak bear? Is it a Kodiak bear or a Kodak bear? Something about a Kodiak bear. Now I'm seeing a koala in my mind's eye. Get 
getting to know truth, getting to know you, my loveys. One brings you success. Brung, 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 brock, <clears throat> Barack, Nicole, Nicoletta, Alpharetta, a Mercedes truck, a white Mercedes truck, like the ones that look like a box. Something about Megan Fox, a Range Rover, a white Range Rover or a Range Rover, a Mazda. The Beetle is still flying around me, my lovies. Um, one energy brings in success. One energy brings in a new beginning. Uh, Betsy's coming in, a Chevy. Uh, one energy brings in success, a new beginning, a purple shirt, orange hair. For some of you, are dyeing your hair. You're definitely going to do something to your hair. You're doing something different to your hair. One energy brings in a new beginning. Uh, whether you, whether Spirit was giving us also, it's okay to like lose. It's okay, 25, 11. It's okay to not get your way in a situation, especially if you're between the ages of 25 and 36. It's okay to not get your, and especially if the New York Knicks are important to you or New York is important to you. It's okay to not get your way. It's okay to wait for something that Spirit has for you. This is like better for you. It's just coming in for a reason. It's going to be important for some. Because the energy of like knowing when to quit, especially if you're up to illegal shit for some. Um, I'm just a messenger here or someone you know. You know, I mean, I know that it's difficult to talk people out of certain things once they're in it. It doesn't matter how well-meaning you are. Uh, they'll think that you're trying to curse them by telling them, hey, you know, you should probably um, not be stalking someone to fucking kidnap and rape them. It's probably not a good idea. You should probably stop. You should probably stop being a stalker. You should probably stop. No, they think it's like someone's a cop. You probably, it's like they think like you're trying to be like hurtful. And it's like, no, like I'm, I'm actually trying to be a good human being. <laughs> but you're not seeing that. Anyways, I'm just a messenger here. Someone's a gym rat too. I'm just a messenger here. Um, what energy brings in success? And for some of you, you may have to detach from... For some of you, you may have to detach. We've seen that energy detaching, people detaching from uh, people that it's like, I love you, but... I'm not I'm not telling my soul with you. I have to I have to go on about my life. For some of you, you could be leaving an environment that no longer serves your your life's purpose or something's become really stale or stagnated. Anyways, let's see. Getting to know truth, getting to know you. What questions do you inspire? What is something you love? No. Other way around. <laughs> love and hate. Someone's confusing what love love and hate. It's the same thing, same energy, but different extremes of the same thing. A passion, a feeling, something, uh, a frequency. What is something you hate that everyone else loves? What is something you hate that everyone else loves? What is something you hate that everyone else loves? Oh, Jesus. Here we go with this exaggerating energy. Everyone loves something that I hate. Everyone loves something that I hate. My lovies, what is one thing that I hate that everyone... My lovies, are you playing in extremes? But you see something that you hate that everyone else loves. Do you see it, my lovies? You got yourself for some of you. You know that the people that you are around, everyone, right? They're everyone to you in that context. The people that you are around... You see that what they like, what they love, what they love to involve themselves in is not something you like. And in fact, you are on the other spectrum of the love the, the love triangle. For some of you, there's a love triangle. Oh, there was, um in the preliminary, there was a love triangle with some type of an officer or an official and his friend's partner or someone he knows. He's effing around with someone's partner. I'm just the messenger that came in in the something about Parker um, that came in in the preliminary. Someone has a teenage daughter or or someone in their twenties. Um, anyways, spirits are calling this man a pervert. But um, something about Rupert. Security. Someone could be in security because I'm getting like some type of officer. It could be a security, an armed security, because armed security just went by. Someone's some a summons. Somewhere's summers. Summers. 
Summer's house. Like Summer as a person, a name. Um. Throttling your speed. Something about speed, the drug. Um, <clears throat> someone's a thug. Um, what is something, for some of you, you don't like what your friends are doing. Or you don't like, um, you know, take it how it resonates. Or you may be part of a crowd and someone in that crowd doesn't like the crowd. Or they don't agree with what the crowd is doing. Because I'm getting like... <sighs> It's almost like a, a conflict of like good and evil. Good in evil. Good in evil. Talk about Eva. Good, something about Eva Longoria. Um, something about desperate housewives. It's like, you know, um, the Stepford, the Stepford wives that, uh, I never got to see the movie, but I'm like, that's creepy. Um, it could be in a community, like it could be something about a community bank. This community bank has been very present. Um, a community pulling their resources together for something. Um, <clears throat> clear the door shut. <clears throat> Trosha, Tro a Trojan horse, a Trojan horse. It's like, um, a setup. I don't know, a community is planning a setup. It is like a Trojan horse. Do you, get, do you get it? Someone's not, <clears throat> yeah, they're not agreeing. A patriot, someone's not agreeing with like, it's like the Stepford housewives, you know, like they all live in a community. And when people move into that community, they have to, 3111, they behave office depot, they behave like that community. But you got to take out the trash. <sighs> it's like a planned, I don't know, it's like a planned, um, it's like a, I don't know, it's like a planned community. And everybody behaves the same and everybody thinks the same. And everybody, it's like they all start driving the same type of vehicles. They all, it's like um, like mechanical, like computerized, radio. I'm getting the song Radio Love. When you're gonna stop breaking my heart. Do, 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 do. <laughs> UPS. UPS has been very present for you. Someone's not agreeing with what a community wants to do because they're seeing like this voting energy has been very present. Maybe for some of you, it has to do with like HOA meetings or having to vote, but you're not going to agree because you're going to see like something's off with what they're trying to do. Like they could, for example, it's like the community wants to put in like it's like you have a planned, you know, a planned lot like it's like or for example it's like investors coming together it has a, a lot to do with like for some of you it has a lot to do with like planned communities like uh, uh like a group of investors like we want to buy this plot of land and we're going to set it up this way it's going to be zoned for this like i'm getting like meetings zoning meetings voting stuff like that and uh like a lot of construction or developing developer a group of developers this could also be a, a group of for some this could be like like actually something about a project manager uh this could actually be like developing like you could be working remote. Oh, everybody working together at a distance. For some of you, uh, the energy of everybody working against you together at a distance. So you could be like trying to negotiate something, but you have people trying to like screw you behind your back and they don't like your vision. For some of you, the energy of also like they don't, when you speak, they don't want to listen to you. So you could be like dealing with people. If you're part of like a, a development crew and like everybody pulls their money together, everything is coming in for a reason. This is the energy. You have some type of dissent. Like, you have some type of dissent in the crowd, in the group. <sighs> like, everyone is not agreeing. Everyone's not on the same page. And the, lo the long term, the longer that you wait for some of you. Something about you, the longer that you wait to go on a date as well for some of you. The longer that you wait, um, something about lilac. The, the longer that you wait, something about lustful. 
someone's wasting their time on lust the longer that you wait to go on a date the longer that you wait um for some someone's putting off uh, a really good connection because they're wasting their time and they're afraid i'm getting a king of cups to the seven of hearts seven of hearts there's something new this is someone new to you an invitation a reconciliation a pregnancy seven of cups energy something about quincy something about massachusetts something about bark bus Something about a bonanza bus. Something about regional travels. The longer that you wait to go on a date. For some of you, something has to do... Something about a date rape drug. Okay, and someone's a thug. The longer that you wait to go on a date. Someone's like postponing something. I'm getting seven of cups energy. Because someone may think they have options. Yesterday I saw this thing. Spirit made us watch... I didn't watch it. I just saw the headline. Uh, people nowadays are losing good connections because they think they have options. I don't know if that's nowadays. But um, boom. That's all coming in for you. <laughs> Take what resonates. Leave what doesn't. I feel like we just went through a bunch of stuff. Um <coughs> Someone needs to clear their throat chakra and be their truth and speak their truth and see their truth. Do you consider yourself an introvert? You know, my lovies. For some of you, you know, you know what your sister from me considering herself. Um, do you consider yourself an introvert or an extrovert? I'm an introverted extrovert, my lovies. I'm an introverted extrovert. I consider myself an introverted extrovert. I love my people. Um, I connect on a spiritual level. I love to connect on spiritual levels. Um, I think the physical makes you forget something. But I do love to be around people, though. I love to be around people, though. I love it. I love it. I love it. Um, when I was... Spirit had a... For some of you, you have a, a, a teenager or someone in... It's like... It's coming in as a teenager. She... she it's coming in as a fila. A fila? A fila? That, your, your fila? Your, your, your daughter? Um, a niña? Una niña. <clears throat> but it's coming in in Portuguese for some reason. Is fila Portuguese? No, it's Italian. An Italian could be significant. You have a, a daughter who is a leader. Energetically. Spirit was giving us a vision of when I was uh, in high school and um, I had this teacher. She would have a tough time controlling the students. And I remember one day, like, it's like she would pass it on to me. So it's like, okay, she, she chose me to be the mediator between her and the class. Everybody voted for me to speak for the class. And I'm like, why me? And the class is like, yeah, you, it has to be you. And I'm like, why, why, why me? Um, she doesn't, for some of you, you have a leader on your hands. So she doesn't know it yet. Or maybe for some of you, don't beat this out of her. Don't, I don't think you will. I don't, I don't think, I don't think I have to tell you this. It's coming in, so I'm gonna tell you anyway. But I don't think I don't think you're. I think you're going to support this person. It feels like very supportive parents and a teenager who's a phenomenon, a phenomenon, a phenomenal. Uh, she's a phenomenon. This the, you have a, a teenager around you. Uh, protect her, my lovies. Very beautiful young lady. This is what's coming in. Um, who's not shady? For some of you, there is a shady young lady though in the field. Um, what was who's being loose sexually? I'm just a messenger here. What was the worst purchase you've ever made? What was the worst purchase you've ever made? What was the worst purchase you've ever made? I don't know if it was the worst purchase or the best purchase, but after I bought, um, I always wanted to own a property when I was younger. And so I, I, uh, I did that. I, I uh, got my first mortgage home in Rhode Island and I regretted it. I regretted it. It was a beautiful home. Um, I was able to do what I wanted to do. So Spirit um, put it in us to renovate the basement and make it like an in-law basement. And I got to do that. I got to do a lot of stuff with that property. Um, but I owned it for three years and then I sold it. And the appraiser at the time didn't want to raise the... It was already the most expensive property in the area. And the appraiser at the time did not want to work with me um, because I wanted to sell it for more and, and I had invested. And the family that wanted to buy it, they were willing to pay what I wanted for it. And the appraiser said no. The appraiser said no. 
And so uh, now it's so curious because now looking back, I'm pretty sure that the properties in that area are way more. <laughs> but at the time, the, the appraiser said no, especially after he saw me. <laughs> Racism is a thing, Matt Levy. Classism is a thing. People will try to discriminate for any reason. But um, yeah, he said no to me. He said no. And uh, so I, I, I didn't lose a lot of money, but... <sighs> yeah it's like I broke even we'll call it that I broke even so but I mean I was happy because the family that um they ended up buying anyway because I'm like they said no but I'm still gonna sell it to them I'm still gonna sell it to them so they ended up buying and they needed the house because it was perfect for them they did have their in-laws that could stay in the uh, in the basement and all this other stuff so it was a really it actually you know energetically it made sense so I'm like oh I'm okay with that I'm okay but um I don't know if it was the worst purchase um but it's something that I'm like oh, I don't know I don't regret anything I really I don't I don't regret anything I've I've bought because either if, if it was for me or I'm a firm believer like I do this all the time uh when I have money <laughs> um I do this all the time like for example um I was at a store and I do this I do things like this all the time I'm at a store and spirits like uh get that chapstick and I'm like we need that chapstick and spirits just like get that chapstick and then later on in the day i had a gentleman he's like my lips are so dry i'm like oh look i got this for you and he's like you got this for me i'm like yeah it's brand new i just got it for you spirit told us to pick it up on the way here and and i know i knew there was a reason here it's for you so if it's not for me it's for somebody else that's how i i look at it like these things for example i always end up giving this away <clears throat> i always end up giving these away is this what it is? I've had so many of them. There was one necklace I I bought for a thousand dollars, and I I gave it to I gave it to a guy at the gym who uh, uh, who lives a life of sin, but it's okay. Um, I gave it to a guy at the gym, um, and that necklace was a thousand dollars. I paid a I paid a thousand dollars for it. A friend of mine is a designer, and he designs um, gemstones and and necklaces with gemstones, and that one was a really powerful one. It was all about birth and rebirth, and uh, and I gave it to uh, someone at the gym who I worked out with for a couple of weeks. And um, your obliques are on fleek, my lovies. Anyways, hope you get what you need from that. This buying of a necklace thing has been very present. Dang, my lovies, your sister friend's pendulum broke. Yesterday I told you we need pendulums. You needed pendulums, but now I need a pendulum too. Dang, my lovies, dang. Dang, my lovies, dang. <laughs> It's all right. Everything's all right. Ooh, I was feeling seven of swords energy. I was also feeling. I told you. Um. Oh, because with that, with the, with the tower, and the death came the ten of swords as well. So this is how for me that energy is death energy. It also came in with spirit told us someone's gonna die. A man's gonna die. Um. But um, he's gonna fry. But um, for others that that does not apply to, we got a ton of swords. Ta-da! I told you you've been through a lot and the worst is behind you and you have a new beginning. You have the one, you have a new beginning. Ten of swords energy, nothing can get worse than this. <laughs> ten of swords energy, you've been betrayed. You've been left out. You've been set up. People lied on you. People gossiped about you. Gossip was very present last night. People gossiped about you. They could help you, but in, sp in spending, in spending, they spent money to harm you. <laughs> they spent money so you don't have money. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? Isn't that crazy? I think that's fucking crazy. Um, for some of you, someone did this just because they felt rejected because you didn't want to have sex with them. For others, these were business partners. For others, these were friends. For others, this was your brother who did black magic. Welcome to the club. Um, your brother is a thug for some of you. Ten of swords energy. Look at you right there, my lovies. You were on your way to fly and someone wanted to catch you right before you flew. Everything is coming in for a reason. You were on a way to flying and someone wanted to catch you right before you took flight. Yesterday, Spirit was giving us, it's like, I, I have mentioned this before. Even on my way to my graduation, I had people following me. I had people following me even on my way to my graduation, minding my damn business. I had people following me, my lovies. I'm like, dang. 
yo some people are heartless they are mental cases we did see that for some of you some someone is going to have to uh plea insanity but ten of swords energy so you were for some of you this energy so many liars um and they blamed the innocent um ten of swords energy so <sighs> something was supposed to take flight someone was supposed to take flight for some of you i'm feeling a crazed ex as well someone was supposed to take a flight or you were supposed to take a flight and it's like the people that you trusted came out right in the right in the nick of time to betray you right before you took the flight like they didn't want something to get off they didn't want they didn't want something to take off right before or right as it's taking off they want to come in and do all of this overdue again for some of you uh, someone feels like this is overdue for you someone feels like someone that's envied you your whole life have never seen your struggles someone thinks things have been too easy for you this is what's coming in for some of you someone <clears throat> Someone has always thought that things have been too easy for you. They also think that you could be bought. This is what's coming in. And Spirit's like, this could not be further from the truth. This is someone has always been envious of you. This could be a couple for some of you. Because there was a weird couple gossiping as well coming in yesterday. So these people betrayed you so that something would not take off for you. Again, it could be like, for example, this channel. I was surprised how many people were coming here. And sure enough, it's, it's curious because when someone started messing around with, with the account, um, I stopped Spirit had to stop talking about subscribers. I remember the day and I'm like, Spirit, like I stopped talking about subscribers and something is it, funny is happening with the subscribers. I didn't expect it. Again, I'm just doing my job. I didn't expect this to 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 be so well received my lovies i think this is well received for the nature of this work i'm i'm like wow holy cow and it's like oh it's taking off somebody wants to come in out of their fucking envy and their lunacy this is what's coming in for some of you it's something like that but this is behind you so technically you know the ten of swords it can't get any more worse than a betrayal it's already done it's done What's done is done. Seven of Swords, they were doing this behind your back. Someone was doing something at night because the Seven of Swords in, in the witch's story uh, is things that are done at night. Someone sneaking into a home, trespassing, sneaking into your accounts. For some of you, we have seen that trying to hack your phones, your account, uh, trespassing, uh, violation of privacy, violation of your spiritual rights. Five of Wands out of competition conflict a group can be fighting amongst themselves for some of you i do feel group fighting i feel a group fighting five of wands energy the sun energy over your happiness over your shining there will be contentment at the end of this all and there's the tower i told you my love he's a tower for the powers the towers aries energy scorpio energy Spirit was also giving us how um, some people feel rejected. Some people definitely feel rejected by you, left out by you. And they're not seeing something about the Bayou or the Bayou. They're not seeing that it's their own energy that made them. It's like, I can't be around you. We don't match. There's also some type of exposure here. So three people. So a smaller group that is in harmony and then this again e-harmony online dating has been very present for some of you and this gra this growl something about growly something about growly something about alistair crawley somebody likes to like i don't know someone likes to uh, mess around with this group here like doing too much they're just doing too fucking much they're doing too much they're out of touch they love conflict crabs in a barrel they love conflict they love to stir shit up they love to always be doing the most they're drama filled they're nosy 
something about Josie, something about Joellen. And then there, there are these people, more simpler. They don't even need to be in a house. They're out in nature, minding their business. For some of you, there's a separation here. There's also a wedge that these people try to draw. It's like they try to separate... I don't know. It's like these people like to control things. They're control freaks, manipulators. And there's a smaller group that's like, let's just go on our own and be at peace. Again, this could be you by yourself. This could be you and a few people. There's a larger crowd and a smaller crowd. And look at how messy the larger crowd is. And the smaller crowd's like, listen, honey, we're going on our own. We're going on our own. We're going to, we're going to, a dissolution has been very present. For some of you, after people being conflicted, trying to cause conflict, there's a tower ruling all of this. So whoever gets to go by their merry little ways and be happy, after a lot of betrayals, a lot of lying, everyone feels betrayed. Supposedly everyone, this is what's coming in, supposedly everyone feels betrayed. Even the ones that were the drama starters, they feel betrayed too. <laughs> they feel played by you. This is like a deal gone wrong for some. This who this person wants to hide here. Look, they want to hide that they worked together, collaborated to try to ten of sword somebody in the nighttime. In the night, I hear them talk. Coldest story ever told. To a woman so heartless or a group of women heartless, Liz. How could you be so heartless? How could you be so heartless? And we have 13 wands. 13 wands. They're stressed. They're stressed waiting on some type of news to come in. They were working really hard causing turbulence in communication in the preliminary there was something about a wedge someone was trying to draw a wedge so it's like if you had this is more they're giving me spirit saying um like a gatekeeper in a company this is more than a gatekeeper but a gatekeeper could be involved a blue a blue bmw this blue bmw energy has been very present Someone's pregnant. It's like trying to draw a wedge, trying to create a wedge, trying to create space. For some, someone's trying to create space like the president will see you now. I'm seeing, uh, what's that movie? Coming to America? Something about the royal penis? I don't know. For some, something feels like, again, this energy of a harem or unconsciously creating a harem. But like, unconsciously creating a harem. For some, these could be a group of women who are not necessarily like someone's partners, but they're fucking around all the time. But they see no future with any of these people. So they're unconsciously creating a harm. Everybody knows that everybody sleeps together. Again, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. I'm getting a few different energies. And this harem was like trying to uh, start a war, stir up shit, stress somebody. For some, this harem like knew. So like someone's a delusional. I don't know why you would do this. But it's like sleeping with a bunch of Judases and telling them everything. Like they get to pillow talking and it's like, oh, I found this person that I really like. So why the fuck would you do that? This is what's coming in. I'm just a messenger. So like someone got to talk into a harem. Again, unconsciously creating a harem. And this harem got envious. And they were trying to plan how to have somebody left out, how to cause a tower in somebody. So they, they, this is gang stalker energy. So a harem became a group of gang stalkers. Again, I'm getting a group of females, but take it how it resonates. There's definitely a group of females. A harem became a group of gang stalkers, started stalking someone they don't even know because someone had a love interest. I'm, the, I'm gay. Someone says they're gay. I don't know. I don't know what that means. They could go swingers too. This this harem is materialistic. And this harem is getting blocked. 
Oh, they do they want to hide it. <laughs> uh, this harem is playing games. There, someone's getting arrested. And they're getting blocked. This harem is materialistic. They're getting blocked. They're confused as fuck. They're going to get arrested for playing games. This harem also thought they were not going to get caught. This harem, because again, it's like the way it's feeling. Something about your sister friend. Someone's sister friend. The way it's feeling, this harem needs inner healing. The way it's feeling, it's like a group of people that don't know somebody. Even the 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 ringleader, the harem maker, something about the Harlem Shake, the harem maker, someone's a fake. Like this person commented, they commented on something. This could be someone you met on social media or someone met someone on social media. Take it how it resonates. I'm getting a few different energies. It's like someone saw someone or met someone on social media and then got to talking to the harem about this. And the harem became envious because they knew or they felt everybody like is like intuiting that something's up. Something about a truck. Someone has a Mercedes. And I'm seeing like those Mercedes trucks, the more rounded ones. Um, I was getting in the preliminary someone blaming you for everything. Blaming you for everything. So this harem started acting like bullies to somebody. Again, take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Uh, follow your storyline. I'm getting a few different energies. But this is the energy. Succubus and incubus ties. Sex demons. So these sex demons became obsessed. With someone that they don't know. Who they see as the best. This person's the best choice. And I'm getting the song. Is someone getting the best, the best, the best, the best of you? Uh, someone's getting under this harem skin. This is fucking dangerous. Some people don't see. They live unconsciously. They don't see. This is dangerous. So you have a group of delusionals chasing someone around. Blaming someone for everything, blaming you for everything. This harem or a group of people are pointing their finger at one person or at a smaller group. Take that how it resonates. To ten of sword them. This is a group of people working together. Three of cups energy. Who also, I was getting something about they also steal. Because I'm getting like your sister friend. Like it's like, for example, like they are liars too. It's like they steal ideas from somebody so they then they try to act like someone imitate this copycat energy was also very present in the preliminary so then they steal from somebody or they're watching someone from private accounts they're trying to be like them they're trying to communicate mirror triggers mirror triggers pisces energy cancer energy <sighs> Something about Scorpio, a Capricorn wants to come into, a Virgo. Those seasons could be significant. We got Aries with the tower, Aries Scorpio energy with the tower, an Emperor, strong Aries energy. Um... For some, it's like someone met someone online. You could have been online dating. You could be online on your platform these people again someone is watching or a group is watching everything you do and they're trying to cause towers for you because they're fucking envious and delusionals and these are succubus and incubus's energy and they're trying to block your blessings what did i say or they're trying to throttle what did i say something about a model they're trying to block your blessings they want to keep you trapped. What the fuck is wrong with these people? And random one night stands. I told you. They have some type of weird plan. For some of you, this sending someone a man energy has been present. Especially if you are a female. Like someone, this group of nut jobs, delusionals who are under some type of possession when it comes to sex. Um, they also, they like to play with hex work too. So these people would turn to dirty antics. They'll try to sabotage things for you. Again, hex work could be paying someone, paying like a prostitute man to go and fuck you. Like energy like that, like delusional energy. Some people just have way, oh my God. I'm telling you, my loveys, the things I be seeing in this readings then they want to hurt the, the messenger. Don't hurt the messenger, my life. 
<laughs> Don't hurt the messenger. I love you. Queen of Cups. Cancer, strong cancer. Four of Pentacles. They are definitely stealing from you. Greed. They're trying to hold on to your energy. I don't know how. How? Page of Pentacles. Taurus, Capricorn. Seven of Wands in the reverse. Ace of Wands. These people definitely like a lot of fucking sex. Perverted sex. Lustful. It's not even like... It's just, just to get off. There's no love. Just to get off. Five of Pentacles. Ooh, two of Cups in the reverse. There's no love. Two of Cups in the reverse. There's no true emotion. It's like fucking a fucking blow-up doll. This is It's the equivalent of fucking a blow-up doll. This is the message. Or a bunch of blow-up dolls. These are the messages. Because we got the Emperor. I told you. What did I say? The Emperor energy. Ooh. Is this Emperor in the reverse or in the crooked? Up. These people are also blaming an Emperor. So they could be blaming the boss. They could be blaming the Divine, you know, Divine Masculine. Take that how it resonates. Take it how it resonates. Uh, they could be blaming your partner or your potential partner they could be blaming a father they could be blaming these people can have actually daddy issues uh their father may also be involved trying to school them like my daughters someone has messy daughters this this is a messy crew they know each other or their families i don't know i'm getting like incest involved in a situation there's this um spirit showing us these twins that uh married a really wealthy man this was like their plan like a group of people but there's this these twins they're they're famous and they married a a, a wealthy man like this is that type of energy i don't know this was coming in i'm just a messenger this is giving me a headache but we have um they were blaming they're also like this is someone that was like friends with this emperor We have the chariot and we have justice. So strong cancer, Libra. And gain, nine of pentacles. <clears throat> so there's somebody, okay, the theme again. Someone or a group of people moving away from things that do not serve them. Toxic connections uh, based on betrayals, lies, deceit, manipulation. Ten of swords energy. If you go through, someone went through all of the swords with these people. They blinded them to the truth. They forced them to make decisions that were not in their best interest. For some of you, this energy is coming up. This energy is going to try to revisit you. It wasn't the preliminary. Um, you're going to be, uh, someone's going to try to force you to do something that is not in your best interest. And they're going to try to force you to do something against your your will and spirit's gonna have them foot the bill because they're blocked energetically it looks like they're blocked anyway you're blocking them the divine is blocking them it's like you're not you're not doing this anymore i don't want to do this anymore song the song i don't want to do this anymore they were all judases and you know this and something about judas they could be there could be officers for some of you these people could actually be called like they could be calling the police they're gonna call the police this messy crew someone wants to call the police on you a young brunette a light-skinned young brunette who's a fucking liar. This is what's coming in. For some of you, there are delusionals because they don't want to let you go. I really want to be with you. This person's cheating on someone else. I can't leave you alone. Trauma bonds. Succubus incubus energy. Again, someone is cheating on their man with someone else who they don't want to let go of because it was all part of their... This is messy. This is messy, messy. And someone's taking control back over their life. And these people don't like it. This is what's coming in. Take what resonates, leave what does not. Six of Pentacles. 
they're gonna pay someone if somebody works in in courts or uh some type of law enforcement or agent or something because i'm getting a bunch of things so i got something about the fbi earlier this person they like to pay for spies and all they do is fucking lie this person i'm telling you I told you once I, I applied for the police um, academy and they judged me based on my money. They didn't even give me a fair chance. They didn't even look into my background. I thought they were supposed to do an in-depth background check. They never did anything. They never did anything. They didn't do any of it. They didn't do any of it. They didn't do any of it. Aquarius season, January, the star. My God. Aquarius season, January, the star. January January to February. Someone's a drunk. This pay this paid. They paid. This person paid. And they're under judgment. There's going to be a judgment. Archangel Gabriel. Sagittarius energy. No. Not Sagittarius, but a Sagittarius wants to jump in. Karma. The wheel of fortune. This is big energy. This is really big energy. Healing uh knight of swords definitely an officer or some type of like lower ranking officer and the king of cups wants to communicate to a queen of wands leo energy scorpio energy but there's instability going back and forth over death and ending you also 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 fausto uh, and Eight of Swords, going to prison. Someone definitely will be going to prison. A group of liars for what they did with work or something that has to do for work. News to come about a judgment and they're going to have to move away from a situation. These people have been traveling a lot as well. They wanted a gain from having someone left out. They wanted a gain from destroying something for someone. And the courts are involved because we have a lot of legal energy here. I would not be surprised if before we end a knight of a knight of swords. A knight of swords already showed its face. A king of swords energy shows up. Someone's also, I, I did get the words, they're defending you behind your back. So now someone's like actually like coming to terms with the fact and the realization that they were dealing with really evil people and they're defending someone or, you know, take it how it resonates. There's an innocent person or group being defended. Eight of Wands energy, traveling, telepathy, communication, Nine of Cups energy, wish fulfilling, wish fulfilling, something about a self-fulfilling prophecy and a drunk. Someone's a drunk. Someone is a drunk. Someone is a drunk, drunk, drunk. The devil. Capricorn, someone is a drunk, drunk, drunk. Someone, I've been this whole day, um, as, per, as I was preparing for all of this, something about Parisha. Something about Dream of Parisian. As I was preparing for all of this, all of the projections in the field, like some people are really struggling and some are smuggling. Some people are really struggling. They're really struggling because of all of their negative projections, all of their negative manipulations, their addictions, Strong sex addiction here, but also drug addiction for some. I'm getting someone that takes pride in saying like, I'm seeing a man, but take it how it resonates. Like someone takes pride in saying like, I don't do hard drugs. I just smoke weed. That's all I do. But everyone you keep around you that you're fucking around with, they do hard drugs. So you take on their energy. So in a way, you do hard drugs. Four of Pentacles, the people you're holding on to for a sense of stability or an illusion of stability. I'm just a messenger here. This is what's coming in. Nine of Cups energy, wish fulfillment, ambitions, and there's a Seven of Swords to try to get away with some bullshit. Lying, stealing, cheating. A legacy, Ten of Pentacles energy. Because I feel like these women, for some, or a group of people, are working as hit em up girls, hit em up guys. They're working to get somebody's money or to get someone's legacy, their energy. Your Ten of Pentacles is your tree of life. Wherever you go in this on this planet, you become that Ten of Pentacles. 
If you live in your Ten of Pentacles, that Ten of Pentacles sends out signals and it attracts what you need. These people are greedy and lustful. They are controlling someone through sex. Sex magic. A forerunner could be significant. A gunner. On the low. We got on the low people who are also on the low. Nothing but a runner. A gunner. A runner. And they're doing spell work against you. An escort who is selling it. They behave like prostitutes. Again, take what resonates, leave what doesn't. A Durango. <sighs> Something about Durango, Mexico. A Mexican could be significant. Three of Pentacles. And this is a community of people working together. And they do turn to dirty antics. And they're going to get arrested. And uh, I was seeing a Gemini in my mind's eye. This Gemini is lying a lot, though. They're not, they're not taking accountability. Um, but they're about to, uh, the lover's choice, Gemini energy to heal temperance energy, temperance, angel energy. Good for you. My love is good for you. Boom. <laughs> this is interesting. Wording is coming in. Um, uh, boom. Uh, you have no clue what Quincy can do. <laughs> That's what's coming in. A Lincoln for some could be significant. A Vons, a Ralphs, Albertsons. Here we go with this checking resumes. Great happiness for your great happiness. You have great happiness. I told you, my love, you got one energy, new beginnings. Ah, sushi. Go win Japanese. I think a Japanese person. Go win Japanese, Leslie. Go win Japanese. I think I'm go win Japanese. I really think so. Go win Japanese. I think I'm go win Japanese. I really think so. Someone is working against you behind your back, but it's dropped. But they're hiding. They're working behind you, but they're working behind you. They're also working behind you. They're working. Uh, this person can literally be like sitting behind you right now for some of you. Um, I'm seeing someone like literally like you're you're doing, you're watching this and doing something, working, doing whatever you're doing. And someone is literally like right behind you. Um, <laughs> I'm looking at this blonde female next to me <laughs> with, with a... Um, Spirit wants me to describe her fake eyelashes. She has a lot of makeup on. She looks like she didn't even sleep. She looks like she 